Hi friends, I am Muhammad Ahmad and you are watching Kids Learning Channel. Today I will read very interesting story, the story of the small bun. So let's get started. The small bun, written by Martin Weddell. A hungry man baked a small bun. He sat down with his wife to eat the small bun. But the small bun hopped off the dish and ran. Its little leg ran too fast. Then the bun got away. The small bun met a hungry sheep by the gate. Yes, 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 said the sheep. I am too fast for the man and his wife, and I am too fast for you, said the man. It little lad ran too fast. Then the bun got away. The small bun met a hungry goat in the lane. Ha ha ha! Stand still till I eat you," said the goat. Ha ha ha! I am too fast for the man and his wife and the sheep. Ha ha ha! And I am too fast for you," said the bun. Its little legs ran too fast. Then the bun got away. The small bun met a cunning fox by the river. What a plump little bun, said the cunning fox, licking his lips. Aha! I am too fast for the man and his wife and the sheep and the goat and I am too fast for you, said the bun. But the river was there, the small bun was trapped. It kept running about with the fox running after it. They ran so fast that they ran out of running and stop. Ha ha ha! You have beaten me, fox. Puff and puff. Get on my back, and I will carry you across the river. If I get on your back, you will eat me," said the bun. Ha ha ha! Trust me," said the cunning fox. <coughs> the bun got on the back of the fox. But the fox stopped in the middle of the river. Why you have stopped? Asked the bun. Ha 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 ha! To eat you, said the fox. Glup, yum, yum, yum. And that was the end of the bun. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you like this too. I will meet you in my next video till the take care of office. And please don't forget to like and subscribe our channel. Bye bye.